Swami Prabhupada once shared with me that all of the knots of maya, all the knots of illusion and, and ignorance, that they are automatically untied when placed in the gaze of awareness. And as you ruminate on that idea that all of your faults, all of your shortcomings, all of the kinks of your personality will be taken care of simply by becoming aware of them. It's interesting that Eckhart Tolle says that ego is the unobserved mind. And so that implies that ego also is dissolved through attention, through seeing, through awareness of it. And that your natural self, your free self, your true self, will slowly become manifest as you become aware of the workings of the mind and the knots become untied and your reactions become authentic to this self defined by love, defined by intelligence, defined by being. And that all of our spiritual practices that we undertake, our meditations, our prayers, our studies, really in some form or other are to establish that awareness that this idea of concentration that Swamiji talks about so often in his writings this one pointedness is exactly that it is that uh, focused awareness awareness that doesn't get forgotten that doesn't get ignored so that we always remember to be the witness. And through that light of awareness, we're transformed. That the power of transformation lies in awareness. And not in each of our vices being changed individually. That we don't spend our life trying to be a nicer person, trying to tell the truth, trying to be kind, trying to not be selfish that putting out a forest fire by stomping out one little fire at a time with your foot isn't going to work. That what works is, is going to the very source of the fire and becoming aware so that you can see this unobserved mind that ruins your life, that reacts out of a dark place, a place of selfishness, a place of lust or greed or anger, all of these things. So remember, to be aware, to be aware of awareness, to be aware of that light deep within you. Let it shine, as that old Christian hymn says, <laughs> that little light of yours. Let it shine. Always be aware that you are a light. You are a light of love for this world. That's why you're here.